Hey what's up guys welcome to fine gap and in today's video I'm going to teach you how to create a pop-up in your WordPress website using Elementor. In this video we will learn to add a button on our website and when you will click on that button we will show this type of pop-up. Obviously this button and this pop-up is completely customizable so make sure to watch the video till end. So straight to the forward without any delay let's start. I am on my WordPress dashboard. First of all, click on plugins and click on install plugins. After this, click on add new plugin and search here exclusive Elementor add-ons. Press enter. You can see that you have to install this plugin. It is already installed in my case, so I'm not going to install it again. Next, you have to install another plugin name anywhere Elementor and press enter. Here you can see that you have to install this plugin. AE is its current logo. This plugin is developed by WP Vibes. Just click on install it. Once you will install it by clicking a button here, you will see this activate button and then just directly click on it. So you can see that anywhere elementary is activated. Now I will also activate the exclusive add-ons elementor. So this plugin is also installed successfully. Next click on pages and click on add new page. I'm going to name this page fine gap pop up. I will just click on publish and publish. I will open this page in a new tab. Next again go to WordPress dashboard and here you will see an option AE templates. Just click on it to create a new template click on add new button. I'm not going to name this fine gap pop up template. This template is for that's how your pop up will look like. I will click on edit with Elementor. Next we need to design a pop up. So I will click on this icon. Here you can see that there are many available templates. Mostly these are pro templates, but we have to use the free one. I'm going to choose this free template which can be found by selecting call to action option from here. I will select this and next click on insert. So you can see that this template is inserted successfully. You can also change its content using Elementor. Let me change its width to full width. I will click on publish. Okay. So friends, I'm not going to customize this, but still you can customize this content, its background color or add more content according to your exact requirement. But for example, I'm just directly using this template. Next step is we have to add this template to our page that we have created. Open the WP admin again. We need to publish this before leaving this page. Open the WordPress dashboard. Again click on AE templates and this time you can see that we have another template available here. Copy this short code from here. Click on pages or you can directly open this page from here. I will click on edit with Elementor. So here is page available that we can edit with Elementor. I will search here a model pop up. I will directly drag and drop that here. Okay, we can design this, we can control its width and height. From here, type of model, I will select short code and paste the short code that we have copied earlier. Now click on update and let me click on preview changes. Scroll down, currently you can see that we have this big button, obviously you can customize this. And when I click on it, friends, you can see that a pop-up is appearing in front of our site so friends i hope that this video will be helpful for you if you have any question you can ask us in the comment section we will try to answer your question and please subscribe to our youtube channel for our regular videos and finally thanks for watching